In this video, I'm going to show you one of the most slept on plays in Trips Tied In. What's good, YouTube? My name is Cody. If you want to check out my full Trips Tied In offensive ebook, check out the Patreon. The link's going to be down in the description. That's where you can get access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. And today we're taking a look at one of my favorite passing concepts out of Trips Tied In. And we're taking a look at the uh, X spot. Now, this is actually in the Detroit Lions offensive playbook. We have ebooks on Trips Tied In out of New England and Detroit, two of the best. Uh, playbooks for trip side in and today we're going to be showing you x spot now x spot is a super super under the radar play in my personal opinion especially now because we have receivers that pretty much all have short and elite or some type of route running ability uh, that's going to help it get separation we're going to kind of use this play uh, similarly to the way uh, people that like to run the Indianapolis Colts bunch use the play mesh spot out of tight. So what we're going to do, this is really designed to attack when our opponent um, starts to put a lot of zones on the field as well as just different types of cross man. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually run this to the short side. We want our trips to be on the short side of the field. That is really, really, really important. Ideally, you have short and elite on your tight end. That's going to help him get better separation against man. So all we're going to do is we're going to motion this guy. Now, really important, we're going to motion him to the left or to the trips side. Okay, so if you were flipping your trips, you would motion him to the right or to the trip side. And what you'll notice is there's a secret motion where he will go into basically a slot receiver position. From there, this is going to give us a ton of uh, things we can do with it. So what we're going to do is we are going to take uh, the circle receiver here and we are going to put him on a streak to clear out all of the zones. And then what I like to do is either a couple different things you can do, but simple is always best we're going to drag mike evans so you don't need hot route master i recommend set feet lead i think set feet lead is super helpful for this but that's pretty much it and then we'll block our running back so we have time so you see here this is the basic concept we have a high low to the right side of the field if that tight end has short and elite he'll beat man coverage pretty consistently you've got a backside drag is kind of a check down read and then you have you know your clear out street and your post and so what you'll see is against man coverage, this post is really good at getting separation. This post is one of the best routes in the game at getting separation against man coverage when you motion it across. So when you take it from a corner route and you turn it into a post route, you start to see the full potential of this. Now, uh, if you get it, you notice here he's going to get that sharp cut. And then you see right there, you can kind of throw that over the top of the defender. Now, the other thing that I want to say is you will need a little bit of time for this. Obviously, in practice mode, you get shedded like crazy. Um, you know, But what you'll see here is the tight end is also there for you. You have your drag. You're also blocking uh, your running back. So you should have uh, pretty decent pass protection. Uh, everybody's getting bumped like crazy. Good old Madden 23. That's literally the name of the game. But you see right there, we're able to throw... Um, you know, we're able to throw the tight end route, and then I'll show you this route to uh, Chris Godwin as well. Again, this is more so for when they're starting to run a lot more zone. Um, you know, but this can be good against man, especially if you have the if the if you have the right abilities. This can be really good. I don't know. Look at this. This, this literally sums up man twenty three right now. Um, just for fun, I want to show you this. So this guy is on a ten yard out route. This is why you need short and elite because they actually run their routes right. This guy's on a 10-yard out route. Watch what he does. He gets bumped here, and he runs like 30, 30 yards down the field before he turns on an out route. EA Sports, it's in the game, fellas. Um, <laughs> so, anyways. Uh, but, anyways, that's the idea. So, And then the other thing is a lot of people actually really like to shade um, – or not shade, but – they basically play backed off main coverage or off coverage. Um, that will make this play really, really effective. The drag will be much more open than it normally is. And then uh, your tight end will also be much more open than he normally is. Now, let's get into zone uh, and show you some zone stuff. Again, the man stuff's pretty straightforward. Like, you're looking for, um, you know, you're looking for your post, and then you're looking at your out route and your drag. Like, pretty simple. Um, now, against zone coverage, what you're going to notice is that clear out is going to do a great job of clearing the zones. And you're actually wanting to throw this right there, and you want to ag it. 
you want to cut it off before the safety can come in and actually make a play on the football. So you've got to cut this off. That's really important. Um, like really, 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 really important. So that was cover three. I'm going to show you cover four. Um, I think cover four, in my opinion, is the best zone to defend this. But you'll see right here again, if I could freeform that away from the safety or just, again, just ag it away from the safety, we're going to be in really good shape. Uh, Trips tied in really does a great job, I think, of spacing the field against zone um, really effectively. And when this route right here can also double as a really good man beater for you, um, you know, that's where you start to see this really become a very powerful offense. There you see man beater over the middle, big play. Now, chances are they're going to want to use her this route um, because it's that big, it's that that powerful of a route, right? They're going to want to use her the route, okay? So if they do use her the route, then that's where we want to check down to our drag and to our out route, okay? Um, Cameron Bray is doing this out route like an incredible disservice. So I'm actually going to sub in Chris Otten and we'll show you uh, him running that. But the out route's really good, especially if you have tight end apprentice, or not tight end apprentice, but uh, short end elite on your tight end. Um, I try to say that as much as possible. Get short and elite on the field. It is the best route running ability in the game, by far. Um, by far the best route running ability in the game. Anyways, you'll see here. Here's Otten, someone with a little bit more common sense, able to run the route right. And you see he's beating Stephon Gilmore over the to the outside. So really simple little play, uh, but really, really effective. Last coverage I want to show it against is uh, cover two which I'll just create a baseline cover two. We don't get a lot of cover two um, right now. Just just rarely uh, do I see someone just sitting in a cover two. But if they're in a double Mabel, they might be. This post route will actually, if you look, I'm on the 20. He'll catch it around the 50. So he's going to get over the top of 30-yard cloud. So actually be deeper than that if you watch this here. You'll see, step up, boom, over the top of a 30-yard cloud and an absolute laser. Guys, X-Spot is a super underrated play, in my personal opinion, from Trips Tight End because it attacks a lot of the things that could potentially slow Trips Tight End down, such as the man blitz, deep zone drops to the trip side. This play really helps you kind of counter some of those things. That's why I love X-Spot. If you want to learn how I run the Detroit Trips Tight End, make sure you're on our Patreon. It's in the link. It's in the description. The link to sign up is in the description. It's only 10 bucks to become a member. You get access to everything. We've got over 20 offensive and defensive ebooks in the Patreon right now. You'll get access to all of them by signing up today. If you want to go sign up for the Patreon, head down to the description of the video and click the link down below.